Suzanne Pickett. I manage systems engineering for Columbia Sportswear. My team manages systems engineering, so global infrastructure, at 46 locations in 14 different countries. We manage server, desktop, and the virtualization layer. We today are 90% virtualized globally, and what that allows us to do is seamlessly migrate workloads between our data centers. And in fact, we've quadrupled our systems that we manage today. My team hasn't grown, but the number of systems that we're managing has grown exponentially. We average almost 400 VMs per systems engineer today. Our VMware workloads are tiered today by SLA for the business. Columbia Sportswear's cloud vision and strategy really incorporates the vCloud hybrid service. As we start looking at our tier three and tier four workloads, it makes sense for us to start moving those to a public cloud provider. That will allow me to scale my data center and really focus on those tier one, tier two apps on premise and allow my tier three and my tier four apps to run off-premise. In order for us to integrate and leverage those tool sets that we already have in-house, the knowledge sets and the team that I have in-house today, we can now extend that to the hybrid cloud service and essentially extend our data center. Columbia Sportswear has really had many conversations with multiple cloud providers and services. What we were really looking for was a strategic partner, somebody that would listen to some of the use cases and the, the stories and the vision that Columbia had and would either work with us or be able to provide solution based on what we were asking for. VMware got it. It was just the right fit and the right solution. So the hybrid cloud service just bubbled to the top for us in terms of solution providers because it really had that enterprise view into what we wanted to do versus the consumer-based cloud provider. Columbia Sportswear has multiple use cases for the vCloud hybrid service not only between data center to private cloud to public cloud, but eventually we we're looking to go public to public and then back on-prem. We also have about 46 remote branch offices, and today we don't have a business continuity or disaster recovery plan for those offices. As the vCloud hybrid service expands, what we're really looking for is that, that DR as a service and kind of that backup plan for those, those smaller locations around the world. Getting onboarded with vCloud Hybrid Service has been exceptional. The customer success team has been there every step of the way. They've worked through all of our questions, some minor issues that have come up, and they're really helping our on-premise teams learn what we need to do to extend to the hybrid cloud service.